Hello everyone, today I'm going to be checking out Fancy Flavors and I'm going to be trying out some of their spiral croissants as well as some of their other desserts. Fancy Flavors is a small woman run business and I've tried some of their macarons in the past and today I'm going to be trying out some of their spiral croissants as well as some of their other popular desserts. Let's go! I'm looking forward to trying their spiral croissants. They only have a few flavors but they seem really unique. I'm back from Fancy Flavors now with my precious spiral croissants and I'm also going to be trying out some of their other popular desserts. To start off, I gotta try their original spiral croissant. I'm really looking forward to this one. It looks like it's filled with a rich custard and I just smell this intense vanilla flavor because I can see all the specks of vanilla bean in there. This is the best spiral croissant I've ever tried. I really love the croissant itself. It's really beautifully crunchy on the outside. I just love as you bite into it. You get a really nice crisp crunch and then the inside is slightly soft. And the main thing is they add plenty of butter to it. So it has such a rich buttery flavor that just coats your tongue. And then the cream and custard on the inside is really nice. It's a little bit tangy and it tastes like they use a little bit of yogurt. So it's got a really rich dairy flavor. And then again, you have all those little specks of vanilla Bean, which really add that punch of vanilla flavor. Next I'm going to be trying out their Milo cookie croissant which is a chocolate malt cookie flavor. Ooh, this spiral croissant's really tasty. I think I like it better than the original spiral croissant. I really love the outside because it's coated in like a white chocolate and then it's topped with what I believe to be Milo cookies. And then the inner filling just tastes like a beautiful chocolate buttercream frosting and there's a bit of a malty flavor to it as well. And just that malty flavor pairs really nicely with the buttery rich croissant. The final spiral croissant flavor that they have today is the mango spiral croissant and I'm looking forward to this one because as you probably already know, mango is one of my favorite fruits. I love this mango spiral croissant. You really can't go wrong with any mango dessert. The space of it's really solid because again, I love the spiral croissant itself. And then the filling is amazing. The mango cream just tastes like something I would get at a fancy bakery that's part of a mango cake. That's really what it tastes like. Just a beautiful, light and airy mango cream with such a rich, fruity flavor. Next, I'm going to be trying their cookie, which is a croissant cookie. It just looks like a regular croissant topped off with cookie dough. And then I assume it's baked because it looks like there's this crispy cookie top. I'm really curious about this cookie because not only is there a cookie top, but it looks like it's filled with cookie dough on the inside. Wow, this one is so unique. It's really sweet. I love the outside. It's like a thick, crunchy cookie top. And then as you bite into it, the croissant itself is really crunchy. And I like how it's nice and thick too. And then on the inside, you have a melty, soft cookie dough, which is also incredibly sweet. But then to balance it out, you have some nice large chocolate chips in there as well. In fact, they're these big chocolate chunks inside the cookie dough. Next, I'm going to be trying out the cream puff. And this one really caught my eye because they do a lot of different designs with this. And they make different faces. So I personally got the angry face. This is a really solid cream puff. I love the pastry of the cream puff because it tastes like there's a nice thin sugar shell on the outside, which really adds an extra sweetness. And then on top, the whole design with the face is just the light whipped cream. And then on the inside, you have the same custard that's really tasty that they also put inside the original spiral croissant. So all these flavors go together really perfectly. Next, I'm going to be trying a couple of their macarons, and this is what really made Fancy Flavors famous in the beginning. This is their cake batter macaron, which is a really popular flavor, and it's just covered in sprinkles. This cake batter macaron really tastes like a birthday cake. You just have the nice crispy cookie on the outside, and then a soft filling, again topped with all the sprinkles, and it really just tastes like it took a big bite of a vanilla birthday cake. Next, I'm going to be trying out their strawberry passion fruit macaron, and I already smell the strong tartness of the passion fruit already, so it smells really fragrant. Ooh, 
Wow, I really like this one. It's just a bite of pure flavor. The cookie on the outside on this one is super light and airy and crispy, almost just like biting into a cloud. And then the inner filling tastes like someone squeezed an entire passion fruit and just squeezed it in all the flavor in the one macaron because it's so tart but also really fruity and fragrant and it just overwhelms my mouth but in the best way possible. It's just a really tropical fun vibe and got a little bit of sweetness in, as well in there from all the strawberry jam that they put in the very center and these two flavors work well together. It's just perfect. Next I'm going to be trying out the ube cream pie and I really love the aesthetic of this one. They do the ube cream pie perfectly here. The crust is so light and airy, it's almost non-existent. So it really lets the filling of the pie shine. It's just this rich and perfectly smooth ube filling. And then on top, you have a really thick layer of whipped cream and you can never have too much whipped cream on top of your pie. Next, I'm gonna be trying out their banana pudding. And I already have a good feeling about this because it definitely feels like it's a bit on the light and airy side. Oh, I love this banana pudding. It's really light and sweet. It just tastes like a banana whipped cream with real pieces of large banana in there. And then you also have a mixture of lady fingers in there just to add a little bit of extra flavor and a bit of a sweetness. And I just love the contrasted textures because you have the soft, delicate cream and then a little bit of bite from the banana as well as the lady fingers in here. Finally, I'm gonna be trying out their pistachio cake. This is layered with their pistachio filling as well as lady fingers and then it's topped off with whipped cream. This is a very pistachio-y cake. You're gonna love this if you enjoy pistachios. It just tastes like a pistachio cream with little bits of ground pistachio in there. And then it's layered with the lady fingers, which I love because they're nice and fluffy. And then of course, you have the whipped cream just to add that extra creaminess to it. So overall, a solid cake. Finally, I decided to get a drink. I ordered their tropical juice, which they make in-house. And this is a mixture of pineapple, orange, guava, and mango juice. This literally just tastes like pog that I would have in Hawaii, except with mango. And I really love the flavor of this because it tastes like it's mostly passion fruit and guava juice and then a little bit of mango juice and very little orange. So I just love the balance of all the flavors in here. What I also love about this is I can still taste the fruit pulp in there and I really love the texture from all the fresh guava in there. Overall, I enjoyed the items I tried here at Fancy Flavors today. I really enjoyed the spiral croissants and those were my favorite desserts. I think they did such a great job with them. They change out their spiral croissant flavors every week, but whenever you go, you gotta try all three spiral croissant flavors that they have because they do such a great job with them. Anyways, I really hope you all enjoyed the video. Make sure if you did to give it a like and also make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.